Continuing coverage tonight, Memorial Health in Savannah is administering an antibody treatment to help in the fight against COVID-19. WSCV News 3's Brian Ray talked to one couple who underwent the treatment. He is joining us now with how it works. Tina, good evening. The hospital is using a monoclonal antibody treatment, which is made in a lab and given to patients through an IV infusion. The therapy serves as a supplement to your immune system. Patients who got the treatment tell me it may have saved them from an even worse case of COVID. I developed a cough and I just really couldn't catch my breath. Leon Parrish and his wife Joyce both tested positive for COVID last month. They also both found out they're eligible for the antibody treatment and decided to give it a go. I work in healthcare and so I've seen people that are on vents battling it and, and you, you know, you've heard stories and so you know what it can do. And we just felt like if there was a treatment option available that would help hopefully minimize those symptoms for us, it was the right decision for us. Joyce and Leon are two of 900 patients to receive the therapy at Memorial. The hospital began using the treatment just before the most recent surge with the Delta variant. The, the main hope uh, for the treatment is obviously for the, the individual to uh, recover from COVID in a quick manner. Um, but the, one of the main things we look at is whether the patient ultimately needs to be hospitalized uh, for COVID. Officials say 94% of those patients avoided hospitalization. It's meant for people with COVID symptoms that don't require them to be in a hospital or on a ventilator. There are also certain criteria you need to meet, including being 65 and older, having an underlying condition such as diabetes, cardiovascular disease, or chronic kidney disease, or a body mass index over 30. The parishes say after 10 days, they were feeling better and back to work. Without the antibody treatment, they don't know if the outcome would be the same. We were blessed. We never lost taste and smell the way yeah, some people do. And, never did. You know, we, it's, it's hard to tell now what it would have been had we not had the treatment, um, but feel like for us, the treatment probably helped. Memorial Health has a dedicated outpatient area in the hospital to give the infusions. Dr. Gard says the entire process takes about three hours. He recommends talking to your primary care doctor to see if you qualify for the treatment. Brian Ray, WSAV News 3 on your side. Brian, thank you.